It's not easy being a financial institution these days. They can do no right, and they're still enduring the pain of ever-increasing regulation from the bad old days. My name is Guy Osher, and I co-head the Financial Services Sector Group at Field Fisher. Here are just three of the dynamics we see in play over the next 12 months. Alongside fintech disruptors, mainstream banks are having to update and implement new technologies and systems. Machine learning in financial services will disrupt traditional banking models, so the banks themselves need to anticipate them. Currently, machine learning is unregulated and its foundations often rely on the quality of human input. Yet it is often not sophisticated enough to learn the nuances that a human mind would apply. But this will change in time. LIBOR is used in approximately 300 trillion worth of financial contracts. Financial institutions, against the advice of some central banks, are continuing to write new LIBOR contracts all the time. Over the last year alone, the volume of contracts based on LIBOR that will straddle its demise has doubled. There are now only two years to prepare for LIBOR's discontinuance. Regulation continues to be high on the agenda. The unclear margin Phase 5 go-live date is still 1st September 2020 for firms with gross notionals over 50 billion. We know that readiness takes a minimum of 12 months in our experience, and it's very resource intensive. In the ever-changing world of financial markets and products, a modern lawyer has to be on top of his or her game all the time, just to keep pace with these developments. We understand that experience is everything. The more we know, the more we can offer to our clients.